Hello everyone, I am Shraddha Purkunde. I am a science communicator at ISA Pune. This video, along with 15 other videos, is part of our Wednesday series. This series is conceptualized and developed by Science Activity Center and is supported and funded by Pratham Education Foundation. These videos would be premiered every Wednesday at 7 pm on this channel. So, subscribe to this channel and let us know in the comment section if you like this video. In the last video, we made three balloons that all behave differently. Now, let's find out why the green balloon floats while the other two sink. The red balloon is filled with carbon dioxide or CO2 gas produced by the reaction between baking soda and vinegar. The yellow balloon contains mostly air and some CO2 which is formed during respiration. The green balloon contains hydrogen gas or H2 produced by the reaction between sodium hydroxide and aluminium. Now that you know the gaseous content of each of these balloons, let's understand why they sink or float. Do you remember the simple oil and water density experiment? Oil has lesser density than water. Hence, it floats on top of water. Like liquids, gases also have density. And this is the reason behind the strange behavior of these balloons. Density of CO2 is more than that of air. Hence, the red balloon sinks in air. Yellow balloon contains 4 to 5 percent carbon dioxide, whereas air contains only 0.04% carbon dioxide. Thus, the yellow balloon sinks as well. Hydrogen gas has much lower density than air. Thus, the green balloon goes up. Carbon dioxide is denser than air and hydrogen. But have you noticed which amongst the red and yellow balloons fall down first? Are you able to guess the answer? Red balloon has higher amount of carbon dioxide. As we know, carbon dioxide is heavier than air. That's why red balloon comes down first. Here is the arrangement of balloons in the order of decreasing densities. Challenge time! Can you find out the density of the other gases present in air? Now that you have made a floating balloon, can you make it float at a constant height? 